I love this car and it's awesome, but I really want to get out of it. I really want to get out. Ladies and gentlemen, it is currently Friday the 18th and it is 10.03 in the morning and here's to the start of my 24 hour Lamborghini challenge. Now this has been a highly requested video from you guys to spend 24 hours in my car. My butt is going to hurt, but let's do it. All right, so we're getting in the car and ho -ho, we'll start the timer. Here we go. So we're also going to start a timer here. So whenever this gets to 24 hours, we can get out of the car or whenever it turns 10.05 the next day, Saturday the 19th. But it's kind of dark in here. I am sorry. We're going to start off the morning with some breakfast here. I got everything to survive in this car. Check this out. Real quick, let's go ahead and start it up. Get some AC in here. There we go. I got a laptop charger. I got my laptop here. I got batteries, extra things for the camera, everything I may need. And then if we go ahead and roll down the window. See that right there? Right there, I got an extension cord plug so I can plug in my phone. If it dies, my laptop, anything that I need while I'm in the car. Oh my gosh, we've only been in here for two minutes. Okay, like I was saying, let's go ahead and start the morning with some good old breakfast. It's 10 a.m., man. My belly is empty. And also guys, real quick, before we get into this video and before we really get into this challenge, I want you guys to leave a like on this video, but not only that, but if that subscribe button is red and you haven't clicked it yet, definitely be sure to click it. Otherwise you're gonna miss out on all the crazy challenges that I post on this channel. All right, let's get some breakfast. On our way to get some breakfast. I'm full. I am full. That was good. You can never go wrong with some Whataburger and hi. What are you doing? I am sitting in this car for 24 hours because my YouTube subscribers wanted me to do so. Or is it that you really got kicked out of the house? What, wait, you wait. give me a tour of the new house? Wait, what are you trying to say? Is this, what are you trying to is say? Is this your new house? What do you mean? This is so nice. Give are you me trying a to tour. say you just, you just kicked me out of my own house? What are you saying? <laughs> Yeah. Okay, well, this is a tour. This is a steering wheel. This is a seat. That's about it. Wow. Yeah, I'll be enjoying the house. So, uh, you enjoy the, your small car. Thank you. With only one extra seat. Shh. Doesn't even have a back seat. No, 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 it does not. You chose poorly on the car to spend 24 hours. That's what everyone asked for. So, like, I don't I'm know. Just saying. It's, it's, it's kind of squeezed in there. Yeah, it is. There's okay. Really no but I'm going to get a ton of work me. done. He's way up there. I'm going to get a ton of work done. I got my Mac charger right here. I got an extension cord. Yeah, look at this. Yeah. What is yeah, that's. I mean, it's kind of genius. I mean, yeah. <laughs> this is what you gotta do. I'm gonna go get food. You uh, enjoy your new house. Have a good time. Okay, guys, I have to get some breakfast. But now it's time for me to get some work done. I'm spending 24 hours in this Lambo and might as well make it productive. I got a ton of stuff to do on the good old lab of the tops. Let's do it. <laughs> we got a charger. This is great. I got the seat reclined right now, so like I'm comfy. The car's obviously not on, but it feels really good in here. It's like 70 degrees outside, so like we're good. Time to get on that grind. <laughs> oh! <laughs> what I'm going to do is I'm going to reply to a, a ton of emails, you know, work stuff I have to do, scheduling meetings. I'm going to plan a ton more vlogs and videos. I'm gonna to go over all my channels and optimize them and kind of figure out like you know what can I improve what can I do better I'm also going to look at the merchandise and see if there's anything we can improve I'm gonna think of new products I'm gonna just do a ton of things I'm gonna get a ton of work done I'm a grind Oh, I need some food. I haven't done all the work that I need to do today, but I've done enough to where I think it's time to go get some food. Just gonna drop the charger on the floor over there. I've been in the car for just about three hours now, and I can say that the seats are very, very comfy. However, my, my butt still hurts just from sitting for so long. I think we're ready for some food. Ooh, I got just my seat back. All right, we are good. Let's go get some food. I'm also gonna stock up on a little bit of water bottles too, because I need something to drink. We have made it to our destination, which is Sonic. <laughs> Oh yeah. We pretty much have to eat like fast food or drive through all day because uh, we, we can't we can't get out of the car. I made a little bit of a rule to myself and I can only get out of the car if I need gas or if I need to go to the bathroom, which 
you know, makes sense. Like, I'm not gonna use the restroom and my, no. Anyways, let's order some food, I'm starving. This car is so ridiculously low, I can't even see the menu. In order to see like the burgers on top, I literally have to go like that. <laughs> I can't reach the button. Hi, could I get uh, a number five with a bottle of water? Hello. Are you recording for like a, is it like a YouTube channel? Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. <laughs> Will you do me a favor? Yeah. Will you take a picture of the inside for me? Can you you could just take a picture, I mean, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, have a good one. Got the food, I got a water bottle. She took a picture of the inside of the car, I thought that was pretty cool. But I got a water bottle because uh, this, this, this car doesn't have cup holders, so um. Kind of got to stick with the bottle. And if this car did have cup holders, I wouldn't trust it. There's a cup holder right here and you floored it. And boom! My plan is to head back to the house, eat, and then pretty much finish up work. And then around dinner time, like four or five o'clock, I'm not really sure yet. Just whenever I finish up work, I want to go drive around a ton, go get some good food, drive around, maybe, 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 maybe. I really want to go do some donuts. Just like completely like shred tires. Maybe we'll go do that. All right. We have made it back to the garage. Trying not to hit anything. Made it. We have made it. We have made it. We've made it. Don't hit anything. Don't hit anything. Don't hit anything. Don't hit anything. I'm kidding, I'm, we're good. All right, park, roll up this window. We'll leave this one down because, well, we need some air. Turn that off, turn that off, roll up this a little bit, and then we will turn this off. There we go. As I said, I'm gonna eat real quick and, oh, tater tots! Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try my best to make the least amount of mess as possible. And then we're gonna hop back on the laptop. It's fully charged, 100%, so we shouldn't have to plug back in. I'm gonna try to finish up all my work for the day, take some meetings, take some phone calls, and then we're gonna go have some fun. So I'll see you guys then. Ooh, oh my gosh. Guys, this challenge is very difficult. I think it's because I'm just in such a small space, but a little bit of an update. Sorry I haven't picked up the camera in a while, but we've been in the car for just about over seven hours now. It feels like I've been in here for 48 hours. It's honestly ridiculous. I did end up getting quite a bit of work done, and also so taking a little bit of a nap. I got just super tired and I just fell asleep. Good news, it's time to have some fun. I need to wake up, maybe grab some coffee, I don't know, maybe do some donuts or get some donuts, that is a possibility. We're gonna go driving, probably for a while. Probably for like the rest of the night till I sleep, I don't know. It's really dark in here, I'm sorry. It's starting to get dark outside as you guys can tell. It's about five o'clock or so. I hope you guys have been enjoying this video. These 24 hour challenges are definitely a lot different than most vlogs because we don't have crazy stuff going on. It's normally just consists of me sitting in a, something for 24 hours or sitting in a Lego house for 24 hours. It's hard to be really fun and like creative and like it, it it's difficult, but I'm getting creative. I'm getting creative because I'm gonna do some donuts. That's what I call creative. Let's go on an adventure. Body. Just a little bit of an update. It's dark outside now. I've been driving around a ton and I'm having a ton of fun. It has been a blast. I'm definitely awake now, but um, I'm gonna show you guys some driving clips. I'm gonna take some driving clips. My memory card filled up, so I had to like pull over and like delete like a ton of like old footage and stuff. So I wasn't able to film that much for a while, but the memory card is good now, hopefully. Should be good. Also, it's very, very hard to film and drive that, and it's also really dark. Like, you guys can barely even see me. That's why I haven't picked up the camera too much, but I've been driving around for honestly a couple hours now. <laughs> I am having the time of my life. I'm going to attempt a donut. However, for some reason, my car is not letting me turn off traction control right now. I don't know why. It's not letting me turn it off. It gives me like an error. Like, it's not letting me, it's, it's really weird. But I will try my best. I don't have that much room, but here goes. car grips so much I'm literally flooring it all right let's just keep going faster and faster in circles until eventually we break loose and oh my gosh the car is still gripping how is that even possible I need to build up some more speed here so I think if I go like <laughs> that didn't work at all. Okay, this is a complete fail. I can drive this car and it can drift well. The problem is my traction control is not turning off. If my traction control doesn't turn off. This car has so much grip, it's ridiculous. It's still gripping. It doesn't do anything. Oh! Oh! All right, back into the garage we go. I have been driving for so, so long. A little bit more, a little bit more. There we go, perfect. Do that and do this. 
There we go. <laughs> We're back in the garage and I think we've been in the car now for like 14 hours, I wanna say. Maybe 13, I'm not really sure. I apologize for not filming too much while driving. It's extremely hard. Like I, I don't have anyone in the car with me. I need to focus on the road. I had this thing so I could mount my camera on it. However, of course it decided to break. And also when that broke, my SD card also completely filled up. So I had to like pull over to the side of the road and spend a ton of time getting rid of like as much footage as possible like old footage and trying my best not to delete any of this footage. I think I'm probably gonna watch a movie or something. I'm not really sure and then probably go to sleep. It is pretty late. I am feeling pretty tired. Only thing I'm worried about is sleeping in here. I mean, I'll be fine, but just don't know how these seats are gonna be. Like, I sometimes have trouble sleeping sitting up. You know, I really need to lay down to get a good night's sleep. So, it's gonna be interesting. I'm gonna try my best to sleep as much as I can. I mean, I would really honestly like to sleep till like 10 a.m. and wake up and be like, yay, 24 hours, we're done. Cause guys, I, I love this car and it's awesome, but I really wanna get out of it. I really wanna get out. My butt hurts so bad. I did, however, get some gas, so I was able to stretch for a little bit and use restroom as well so that was nice but i think i'm gonna try to go to sleep soon maybe watch some movies some tv episodes i don't know i'll update you guys a little bit of an update i've officially been in the car 12 hours 12 hours I cannot express to you guys that it, it, it has not felt like 12 hours there's there's no way it has felt like 12,000 hours. I don't know why it just hasn't felt that long But the good thing is is I'm about to go to sleep I'm very very tired. It's 10 o'clock a little bit past 10 Definitely looking forward to a good good night's nice rest I don't think I'm gonna need a blanket because it is a little bit hot in the garage probably like 7 75 degrees in here. Hopefully I don't get too hot through the night. I guess I can open the garage I don't know. I do need a pillow. I'm gonna text Kate Co. I just texted her. Hopefully she'll bring me one. This challenge has been crazy. Probably not the most difficult one driving around and getting out really kind of like i don't know it really really helped because like staring at this garage and staring at this wall for so long or staring at my computer for so long it was just like i don't know it was kind of difficult but once i oh hello hello, hello. yes it is oh i don't need a blanket it's so hot in here no there's no way i need a blanket I'm gonna bring you a blanket. okay well i'll take it just in case but Oh, thank you. I don't think I'm gonna need this because it's, it's pretty hot in the garage. You know, I just like the, the softness of a blanket. Fair enough. The good thing about this pillow is this is actually, um, it's got like cooling beads in it. It's, it's, so it, it's actually very cold right now. It's really nice, but yeah. So I'm gonna go to sleep. I will see you in the morning. It's, it actually is really hot in here. Yeah, it is kind of hot in here. Hopefully I might have... someone doesn't try and break into the garage. I might have to open the garage. Open it? You're gonna sleep with the garage open? It's, it's then hot in here. you're more likely to have someone, I don't know, <laughs> come in. And I don't know. I'll figure it out. But I'll see you in the morning. Well, um, this is going to be a lame night for you. Knuckles. This is very weird. <laughs> you're going to bed in your Lambo. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to go sleep in our king size bed. Okay, bye. And watch some TV. Yeah, you have fun with that. <laughs> Okay, bye. Lame. Also, if you haven't been able to tell, I've pretty much reclined my seat all the way back. So it is almost a bed. I'm chilling right now. I honestly don't even need this pillow. This, this back headrest is so soft. I'm good. Wish me luck for a good night of sleep. I will see you guys in the morning. Or maybe I'll pick up the camera at 3 a.m. and be like, I can't sleep. I'm going to go drive to uh, McDonald's. One of those two things will happen. Oh, see you guys in the next clip. Oh, she forgot to turn off the light. Flick! Oh, good, good morning. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it is so dark. Woo. Good morning, guys. A little bit of an update. It's like 8 o'clock. I woke up like three other times before this. I woke up at like 7, 7.30 and like 5.30. For some reason, I don't know why, it is like extremely windy outside. And wind kept hitting the garage door so incredibly hard that it was like moving it and shaking it. And it was so loud in here. It was kind of freaky. I thought someone was like banging on the garage door. I was like, what is going on? The seat here was pretty comfortable. I woke up once at like 12.30, I want to say. I just had to like kind of roll over because I was just so tired of just sitting in the same spot. But good news is we have about an hour and a half of the challenge left left and we're about to go to a really sick car meet. Let's go. A little bit of a cold-ish start. Good morning. If you guys have not left a like on the 
this video yet, please be sure to do so. And if you haven't clicked the subscribe button yet and you're still watching this video, definitely be sure to click it, guys, because you are missing out. Because I have some crazy vlogs coming up this week. Seriously, seriously, dude. So click that subscribe button, guys, but let's go check out all these cars. By the way, I am so, so angry, but for some reason, I don't know how. I think I might have did it like when I was trying to wake up and turn off my alarm. I'm not really sure because I woke up multiple times, but the stopwatch completely stopped. Like it's, yeah. As you can see right there, it is like 8.53. And it's also Saturday the 19th. And we started on the 18th at, I think it was like 10.05. So we have about an hour, so. It has been 24 hours. Well, almost. Okay, we have like three minutes. We're at the car show now. Let's get out. Let's see what kind of cars are here. Not too, too many cars, but there's some pretty good ones. It has officially been 24 hours in the Lambo. Oh my gosh. 24 hours has never felt so long. I literally feel like I've missed out in like a week of time. It makes me think and like rethink life and like how long really is 24 hours? But it's more so as like I always keep myself so busy and it's like when I sit here for 24 hours, it makes me think like 24 hours is actually a really long time, at least it feels like, I don't know. It's weird, it had me thinking, but guys, I wanna thank you so much, so, so much for watching this video. This was an absolutely awesome video to make. And if you guys have any other ideas of things that I should do in this car, let me know in the comment section below. I would love, love to see them. Thank you guys so much for watching. Before you guys go, definitely be sure to click that subscribe button. Otherwise, you're gonna be missing out on a ton of awesome vlogs, and you don't wanna do that, because I have some incredible ideas and some incredible things I've ordered from the internet. Anyways, guys, thank you so much. I wish you all a safe and fantastic rest of your day, and I'll see you guys, not tomorrow, but the next day in a brand new vlog. <laughs> oh my gosh. Stretch my legs. Oh. Wow, 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 wow. Ooh, does it feel good to stretch?